Everyone's bought that thing. <clears throat> you know, I started to sing, went to hook this thing up, hit the button, it didn't work. Changed my mood instantly. Why is that? This, I, I was in a happy instant second, I was going to sing for you. I pushed the record, the, it was awful. I want to remind you something. I couldn't, I couldn't sing if I tried using this contraption. <laughs> uh! The controls on this mechanism make, have you ever seen somebody use a backhoe? Would you like to ride around a backhoe once? A little tractor backhoe? Those little controls are very sensitive. And when he makes that thing do all kinds of things, he's learned to just, mm-mm-mm the control. Because he works them all. Something you through a forehandle at once. You get things to do what you want to do. Pretty tricky. Works them back home. Yeah, it is. The guys that do it well, where they make that shovel come right down and go, leave me. Now, some of the more invested equipment, I, I'll, when I was a kid, I worked with guys that could do that with some of the most relic equipment you ever saw in your life. If you tried it yourself, you'd have to spend years, and they did. <laughs> they had years in. A man could take take that old equipment and make it sing. It's long gone. Your technology now, you don't have the craft developed at work at all compared to what was there at one time. You have this technology where you could be the no craft at all and slop this crap in and you I want to plot a goose of war as fast as I can throw it in. Well... And I broke into my apprenticeship in 1968. They saw this coming and told me, I pity you, boy. That same union wit is not at that local anymore. It is not anywhere on this planet. Want to bet? You don't sit and weep like I saw men genuinely cry over the absence of camaraderie with this globe. And make a rabbi's tears garbage. What about? I've been there in the bowels of the ship with men that rowed oars and for the reason they loved the ship with all their heart. They sure did. They're dead and gone. If they're not, they're shutting their mouth. And they got no business shutting it. To not come out. I'd be able to remind this place. Maybe you didn't see enough documentaries. I've been reminded in the United States of many wonderful things about this place. Many, many. So many you can't get angry at anyone. And you can't. And you're quite shook that there's any of it going on. I think I pity you all over this planet. You never were born and raised on North America with the United States. I pity you! I do! You behave like the dumbest buffoon that's ever walked in a human shin bone! All of you! What a bet! I drag this nation into it! Bah! This nation is a dream long before. <laughs> nations! Long before nations. So is China. It's a dream before nations! Barbarine! By humans that sweat and put it together! Never mind. Why the lashes were being laid to their back! You don't have social behavior like you did. You've come a long way that way. But at the same time, your absence of the conversation that brought all of it. You're not. You're moving genuine. Are you going to find out the reason why not? Fix that. And genuine. That's what Kennedy told you. You will listen to John Kennedy's speeches again. Again and again! 
You say he didn't oh, apologize in office. Say he didn't apologize in office enough for you, huh? Huh? Shame on you. Khrushchev did too. They both apologized in office. And what did you do with both of them? Oh, he had a, I don't know what they said happened to Nikita Khrushchev. Bull bunk. I'll tell you why everybody's here from Russia right now. You want to thank one person, get on your face and thank Nikita Khrushchev. You honor your God in any church without hanging up a picture of Nikita Khrushchev on North America. You're a creep. I'll tell you what, every Russian church, North America, picture of Nikita Khrushchev. Bigger than the cross. A lot bigger. Want a bat? Or Jesus will get you. <laughs> tell you. You don't thank Nikita Khrushchev more than Jesus. You're in trouble. I'll affirm you that. No greater hand in Jesus than Nikita Khrushchev. Dork! Confession! The hand of God right now! Confession is the hand of God! Move! Bigger Bones Broadcasting, Norman Woodstock Spalding. Cause a lovely effect today. Have a confession. Live the hand of God. Let's see if we can shut this thing off.